guys are man. Wild. Right away, look at this. You can burn yourself on a flame I mean, like that. These guys really, really got an opportunity here. I think yeah. so. 200,000 bucks. And here we go. The first match is a reserve match from Brazil. Vanderlei Silva. Oh, he's, he's the international Valley Tudo world middleweight champion. Great with his knees. Great Muay Thai fighter. I don't fighter. think they do that in Valley Tudo, though. And he's actually pretty good with those knees. Against, from Holland, Bob Schreiber. He good like Thai boxer. There. Look at that. He's one of the bad boys of the sport, oh, boss. He is a very bad boy. He works with the Bulldog. He's a bouncer to Bulldog. This guy knows more the inside of the gym for fighting. Nice guy from Holland. <laughs> <laughs> very good guy. Very yeah. tough guy. So you've good got free fight. He puts it all out there, huh? Free yes. fight versus Muay Thai. I expect some fireworks in this one. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Kick it off. We got the old uh, stare down going on. <laughs> now, I think both these gentlemen have uh, a good deal of experience stand-up fighting, but I think you're right. Bob Schreiber has about... Uh, 100 kickboxing, Thai boxing fights, and in Holland, eh? a lot of fights in Holland go with elbows to the head and everything. So, and let's not talk about the street fights he had. So, there's a lot of experience right there. Yeah, well, it's going to be interesting. We'll be see what happens because Vandalay has some uh, experience standing up. He's uh, not a bad little uh, Muay Thai fighter either. I think that uh, age might be a factor. Schreiber is 35 years old and Vandalay is 23. Maybe if we go into the late rounds and, and overtime round, that might make a difference. Yep. Well, yeah, I and mean, he carries a lot more weight than uh, Vandalay does also, it's an, and that'll weigh on you in the later rounds. Yeah, but at the other hand, he uses his weight real good in his punching, so... Yeah, if he can keep it on him. Vandalay's coming in, trying to brawl with him. Not connecting. Drives that knee up the center. Whoop, he's well, coming Vandalay, through with a really shot. trying to put pressure Nice on him. right hook by Vandalay. Vandalay probably shouldn't stand there and brawl with this guy. He's, looks like he's a little bit too big of a puncher. That's a nice inside left leg kick by Vanderlei Silva. And he goes there again. He went for the high kick, tried to trick him two low kicks low and then going for the high kick. Yeah, this is a lot of energy here. These guys are exerting early. Vanderlei's going for that double leg, but Bob sp sprawls back. Bob seems to have pretty good balance standing up. Uh, yeah, but conditioning is going to play a big factor in this. He grabbed the ropes. Now, that is illegal. Uh, he will get a warning if he continues to do that. Yeah, this is trouble this here. This is very dangerous right this now. This is trouble right here. Yes, Vanderlei has a mounted position in the corner over Bob Schreiber. What he'll do is he'll wait there until he, well, he releases there. And as soon as Vanderlei, he'll slide his legs up under his armpits there and start raining blows down on him. See, right now he's covering up. He should be trying to reach up and grab him and pull him back down. He's got his back. Now, Vanderlei does have submission ability. He has a blue belt in jiu-jitsu. Yeah, this is not good. Very not good at all. I would have tried to escape the mount right away and go yeah. to half guard or guard, but this is yeah, He's dangerous. just turned his back, and, uh, you know, you, the, guy, the guy, he can't do anything to him, but he can, Vanderlei can do everything to him because he's got his back. He can't punch him because he's got his back turned oh. to him. Now, I, Bob has his knees tucked tight. He needs to keep those tight. If he straightens his legs, it could be the end of the fight. Yeah, like I said, I think there's going to be a little conditioning factor playing here. It's, um, you know, when you're throwing that many punches early in the fight, uh, you know, you've, you've got to be trained for it. And uh, right now, he looks to be a little bit winded. Vanderlei just needs to bide his time. It's a 15 I don't understand minute why round. he hasn't gone for the choke yet. Do you, boss? No, I don't understand it either. He I had him down, and... He's trying to push his nose up, though, and then see, like, this. Oh, there it is. He's going for it. Yes, he's going. It, no, I can't no picture this. Stop it. Yeah, it's, he's, he's got, got the end of the fight. He's squeezing, and he taps, and he taps. Susan Lee Silva has choked out Bob Schreiber of Holland. 
That was a quick victory. Yes. Well, what happened was he threw so many punches earlier, and, uh, you know, um, I didn't understand the fact why he tried to take it down a little sooner than that. Vanderlei Silva, very impressive. Very impressive, Vanderlei Silva. He did just as Ken said he would do. He did to take him to the ground and exert some jiu-jitsu on him, boss. Yes, that's the thing to go for against the striker. To be fair, Bob, Bob Schreiber did take, he did take this fight on short notice. Yes. Here it is. He pulls the face up. The time was 2 minutes and 42 seconds with a choke sleeper. 2 minutes and 42 seconds in the first round. Vanderlei Silva chokes out Bob Schreiber with a rear naked choke. 2 minutes, 42 seconds of round 1. An impressive victory for the for the international Valley Tudo champion, Vanderlei Silva. And he advances into the finals, May 1st. Another angle on the choke. He's got that forearm digging right into his Adam's apple, boss. Yeah, it's perfect. Choke is really good on. He pulls his right shoulder backwards. That's it. Vanderlei Silva, he's an impressive force to watch in this sport. He can punch, he can kick, he can knee, but he can also grapple now we know. So that's dangerous dangerous individual now we're gonna go up into the ring we have a very special announcement that is going to take place in the ring there's Vanderlei Silva victorious again with his trainer Hujamar Federico and in the background his manager Sergio Battarelli an impressive victory for the Brazilian they come from the Shootbox Academy in Curitiba. It's one of the budding gyms. Now let's go up into the ring for a very special announcement. It looks like we've lost a member of our broadcast team. Ken Shamrock is now going up to the ringside, and I think we have a special announcement. <laughs> 